Hello, everybody. This is Brother Luke, Sin City Preacher. I uh, just finished watching a video by a YouTuber that uh, many of us uh, know and love. Uh, the, the teaching on the video was diametrically opposed to what I believe. Uh, it's, a, it's a minor doctrine, so it doesn't matter to me. It's, it's not essential. It's not uh, rising to the level of importance that, uh, you know, I would uh, uh, say I can't tolerate it. Um, you're, you're free to disagree with me on these minor doctrines, these uh, non-essentials. But what I'd like to say uh, about these uh, disagreements is um, this is why I do not respect you. Now, when I say you, I'm, I'm, uh, I guess we need to quote from that uh, that verse, uh, Luke blah blah blah. If the shoe fits, wear it. That is from the Luke. If the shoe fits, wear it. That's who I'm referring to by you. This is why I do not respect you. So what I'm going to say now, if it applies to you, then I just do not respect this particular kind of attitude. Uh, and that is, uh, I watched a video from beginning to end. I listened to every word. I was, uh, I think, giving them a fair hearing, hearing them out. Uh, even though I knew that the argument presented was uh, opposite of the, my conclusion on the subject. But I watched the video with great interest because I was interested in uh, how this uh, person would, would argue their case. And I've done this for years now. I've listened to an opponent, uh, someone who has an opposing viewpoint to mine. And most of the time, uh, what I've gained from watching and listening and being fair is a much better understanding of their point of view. But there have been some occasions where it's resulted in more than that. They persuaded me that I was wrong. So at the very least, we, we, we gain knowledge and understanding of another point of view if we're willing to listen and give them a fair hearing. Uh, and then sometimes something astounding happens, and that is it really dawns on us that, hey, I was wrong and they're right, and, and our, my position has shifted over to their side. But what I do not respect is people who will argue a point of view, particularly if they're uh, uh, if they believe that I'm wrong on a subject, and I've spoken out on the subject at great length. Some of the subjects I'm thinking of, um, I've actually presented. 10 hours, 20 hours, 30 hours of teaching on the subject to support my point of view. Uh, so all my arguments, all my, uh, my evidence or support for my position is there for you to consider. But if you're someone who is unwilling to spend a little bit of time learning uh, the opposing viewpoint and giving it a fair hearing and, and actually considering it, not just watching the video, but listening. If you're unwilling to do that, then I do not respect you. 
I greatly disrespect that kind of attitude, particularly if uh, you're someone who um, is, is quick to um, point out that uh, someone's wrong without actually studying their point of view and considering it. Um, so I guess this is a, another video that I will add to my playlist on, on dogmatists because it's, it's a type of dogmatism where a person is unwilling to uh, consider uh, an opponent's viewpoint. Um, basically, most people, when they're confronted with a, a, a different viewpoint than theirs, particularly on those subjects that they, they dearly love and embrace and defend, if they're unwilling to listen, if their attitude is um, I'm going to point the finger and, and, and condemn and, and say, heresy, heresy, heresy. But then they're not willing to listen. They're like that. They won't even listen. So if that's your attitude, then shame on you. I, I, I don't respect you. Uh, you might find that if you would be willing to go to <clears throat> some of my playlists, and you discover a playlist that is uh, presenting a viewpoint that's different than yours, if you'd be willing to go through it carefully <clears throat> and actually listen and consider it, you, you might be amazed that you've learned that there are some good arguments for the other position. <clears throat> Sometimes you might discover that the arguments are so good that you're won over to the other side. Just as some people have won me over to their side <clears throat> in some cases. So I think I'll title this video, uh, uh, I Do Not Respect You. If this applies to you, if the shoe fits, I don't respect you. Regardless, bless you. In the name of our great Savior God, Jesus.